Gorilla Baby and Gorilla Group are going amazingly. Um, so Kim, your mum, is doing all the right things. She's displaying all the perfect mothering skills. Um, Dad's protective and very curious and wants to meet baby. And the other females are all very interested in keeping a, a subtle close eye on what's going, which is really important because we want them to be learning from this experience. It is actually reasonably calm uh, amongst them. It, it's quite a surprising uh, thing. All the females are, are quite calm. Um, there's lots of pleasure grumbles. They're, they're certainly keeping a, a comfortable distance from Kimya just to give her her space. Uh, gorillas are fairly subtle in their behaviours uh, and you know just the side glances and all those sort of behaviours we're, we're certainly seeing. She hasn't put the baby down since it uh, came out and she's um, napping and resting with it on her chest. Um, she's helping it to the right breast to feed and sharing between feeds on each breast. Um, and yeah, protective and all perfect. The last few days it's been really hard to get a look to see if it's a boy or a girl because obviously um, Kim is being quite protective of it and we're giving her a lot of privacy and respecting the time she needs to adjust to becoming a new mum. Um, but today we are 99% sure that it's a girl so we're over the moon with that. Um, it's yeah, just the icing on the cake. The gorillas are spending the morning inside um, where it's nice and warm and keepers can keep a close eye on what's going on in the morning and then they'll go out at 11 o'clock so um, public will be able to see the gorillas between 11 and 3 um, starting from Friday. Gorillas are a very laid back and quite lazy animal so they like to have long naps in the daytime. Um, so yeah, if visitors can just be respectful that the gorillas need to snooze during the day, um, that would be really appreciated. Um, of course our exhibit at Melbourne Zoo with the gorillas is one of the best exhibits in the zoo and the gorillas have lots of space so keep in mind that you might not be able to see mum and baby um, between 11 and 3 all the time. She might be in the cave asleep or under the tree or something like that so um, yeah, keep be patient and I'm sure you'll get to see mum and baby at some point. <laughs>